Well, Stuart, you knew that France were going to be pretty tough out there today, but you came across a formidable French side. Just sum up your emotions. Uh, I would get to do that one, I think. At times we played some decent rugby, at times we got in the right areas, um, but ultimately we let ourselves down at vital times and, you know, credit to France. You know, they, they took their opportunities when on offer, but did they have to work hard for the first three? Probably not. Um, and that's that's the thing we're bitterly disappointed about. Um, it's tough to take right now, it is. As you say, there were some great moments of Scotland play, some great tries, but you did leave some points out there today. Oh, we did. We did. You know, myself, I let one go. Early doors, which could have, you know, changed the whole momentum of that game. That's uh, something that I'm absolutely devastated with. But look, it is what it is. I think for us now, we need some hard truths, hard lessons about where we're at as a team. You know, we'll stay tight, we'll enjoy each other's company. But we've got two more games to actually show what we're about. At times, we did show what it means to play for Scotland. Um, but other times, we were we were far from good. In terms of the performance today. There were some positives out there, and you could see Rory Darge put in a great performance on his first Scotland start. What will you take from this to build? Um, now, look, as we say, there's there's some decent stuff in there, but you've got to be on the money for 80 minutes in Test match rugby. Uh, and if you don't take your opportunities or you cough up too cheaply, um, we make it really difficult for ourselves. And you know, as I say, France took their opportunities, and that's the difference between. The scoreline right now and it's absolutely horrible, horrible feeling. Thanks very much, Stuart.